Hi, good day. This is Anna Mae from True Awakenings. And I'm back to talk to you about the passion that causes sustainability in your business. And behind the passion is something called a value. Now, there's something that was important to us when we were crazy enough to start a business. When you get to the self-employed world, it's a very different dynamic. And there's sometimes when the economy is affecting us and, and sometimes there's unforeseen circumstances that come into our environment that we are, don't have control over. And that can derail our existing, very secure, very stable marketing plan, business plan, and action plan within our business. And there's only one thing that'll get you back out of bed and fighting the fight to survive and to achieve those goals, and that's a value. Which means it's something that's really deeply important to you. Values are deeply unconscious filters that filters our experience. They are highly fulfilled experiences for us. So if we don't have a life that is fulfilled, it means our values are not being met. Now in business, in the olden days, when you have the call center agents, and I'm sorry for those of you who are, call you and all you want to do is try and get off the phone, that's because of the old strategy of the way that business used to be done in the past. For a sustainable business structure for the future is to have a value-based business. People want to do business with people who feel like they care about who they are and what the benefits are that they will be getting from the experience with us as business owners. And what is the product or the service that we provide? What is the actual solution that we are providing for our clients and our consumers? And what is important to them? When we do value-based business, people will buy why you do it long before they'll buy what you do. Because there's plenty of people in each industry. How is it that some of them are succeeding far beyond expectations where, and others are still struggling? Now, if you think about being a consumer or a client yourself, when you're working with someone and they really have your best interest at heart, that's when you want to go back. That's when you want to build a relationship with that provider or that business owner and that you see them as a partner in your success instead of just a service provider trying to leverage money off you. So to have a sustainable business that you can have some certainty and security in again is discover, rediscover and reinvent if necessary your deepest value for your business. Even when I work with clients and, and they set the goal to earn a certain income and we start asking the questions around what will that income actually provide for them, I can assure you it is the quality of the values behind them that drives them in the first place. So revisit your values. What is it that's important to you? What is the service that you provide solving for your client? What is important to your client? And how do they get that solution? through your service offering. I hope that's useful and that if you wanted to find out some more around that, feel free to contact me. But stay tuned for some more tips and tricks around how you can leverage your business sustainability for the future. Thank you.